Good afternoon students, we are once again back in a video lecture for 12th commerce section for accountancy. We will be today starting a new topic, death of a partner. I am Mahindra Kumar, faculty of Mount Luther Z School for Accounts and English, PGT. Children, death, in death of a partner we need to calculate certain things like international capital, p and assessments account, share of goodwill. There are certain things which are transferred to the diseased partner executor's account. Okay, so we'll see how we will be transferring the share of revaluation, share of general reserves, share of goodwill, share of profit and loss to the diseased partner executor's account. And now we will be doing question number 62. So just pay attention. Okay, thank you. So the question says, Balance sheet of Sindhu, Rahul and Kamlesh who were sharing profit and loss in the ratio 3 to 3 to 4 respectively as at 31st March 2020 was as follows. So now this is the balance sheet already given to you. Further, this says that Sindhu died on 31st July 2020. The partnership deed provided for following for the following on death of a partner. First is goodwill of the firm to be valued at two-year purchase of average profit for the last three years, which were itna. Sindhu share of profit till the date of death was to be calculated on the basis of sales. PNL is calculated by two methods on time basis and on sales basis. Sales for the year ended 31st March 2020 amount to rupees itna and from 1st April to itna. The profit <coughs> for the year ended was itna. Interest in capital was to be provided 6%. Prepare Sindhu's capital account to be rendered to the executor account. So, no problem at all. We will be doing the question now. Who is then Sindhu died? Sindhu's capital account. The partner who dies, we prepare the capital account of the same partner. And we have to show the working very clearly because we get marks on the basis of working in a board examination. Particulars amount debit credit. First of all, we will see how much capital Sindhu has got in the balance sheet. This is the capital 10,000 rupees, 120,000. Sorry, 120,000 is the capital of Sindhu. Now, Sindhu has also taken loan. That was of 20,000 rupees. Now general reserve. <coughs> Share of general reserve given to Sindhu. What is the share of Sindhu? 3 divided by 10. 3,000. Okay. Now interest on capital now for this we will have to show working notes we will be showing working notes for this ok so working notes for this is Valuation of interest on at the rate of so uh, capital of Sindhu was one lakh twenty thousand into six hundred. 
she dies in july so april may june july 4 months 4 by 12 zero so zero 12 ones are 12, 12 ones are 100, 600, 6 fours are 2400. Now valuation of goodwill. What is the valuation of goodwill? Goodwill of the firm be valued at two year purchase of average profit of the last three years. So average profit is already given to us. Rupees eighty thousand. Then goodwill is equal to eighty thousand into two. That comes to rupees one lakh sixty thousand. This is the goodwill of the firm. Therefore, Sindhu's share of goodwill is equal to one lakh. Thousand into three by ten. Sixteen three is a forty-eight. Thousand into three. Rupees forty-eight thousand. Now, what is the valuation of new profit sharing ratio and gaining ratio? <coughs> This is first working, this is second working, this is third working. We have to show children working very clearly, okay. So, ratio of Sindhu is to Rahul is to Kamlesh is 3 is to 3 is to 4. Sindhu dies. It is not mentioned in the question that share of Shin Sindhu is, sell, is distributed among the partners in any of the ratio. So 3 is to 4 will be the new ratio and this same will be the gaining ratio. Because no new ratio is given. So we will treat karenge new ratio or gaining ratio. So 48,000 into 3 divided by 7. So this will be divided over here 2400 by Rahul's capital account by Kamlesh capital account. This is children actually goodwill which we are distributing. Okay. So this will be two zero five seven one okay and forty eight thousand into four divided by seven and this is two seven four two nine so two seven four two nine Two seven four two nine plus two zero five seven one gives you forty thousand. Okay, now distribution of PNL. This again will be distributed in both the partners Rahul and by Kamlesh Capital account. This is distribution of PNL. Okay. Now the fourth working will be for us will be valuation of it is on sales basis. Children. 
so this we will be calculating on basis of sales so this is also very easy because we can calculate pnl suspense by two methods on sales basis and on time basis okay so for this the formula will be ratio of profit to sales so for this formula is profit of last year upon sales of last year into 100 the profit of last year will be two lakh and sales of last year will be <coughs> eight lakh into hundred g project to is equal to 25 percent percentage हमारा आ जाता है 25 percent now profit from first April to when he died 31st July 2020 okay so <clears throat> what is the profit three lakhs into seventy five percent is equal to rupees two lakh twenty five thousand Two lakh twenty-five thousand. Okay. Therefore, Sindhu's share of profit is equal to two lakh twenty-five thousand into three by ten. Sixty-seven thousand five. Three lakh divided by okay. Now, what will be the share? Sixty seven thousand. Five hundred plus so this we will be placing over here children in these two and then we will be totaling it up and then we will be getting the answer Sindhu's executors account will be the answer okay thank you children that's all for today's video thank you very much